Hey, how's it going everybody? Thanks for coming back and checking out the channel. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the channel. Like and comment on some of the videos that you like. Share some with your friends. Don't forget to click that notification bell so you can see them first. And while you're at it, follow me on Instagram as well. I got a really good review from a company who I recently found. It's one of the most exotic scents I have tried to date. I highly suggest you check this out. What I'm picking up on is not exactly what you may be picking up on this scent. And I this is definitely one of my favorite scents that I have come across. It's my wife's favorite, so it's definitely got to stay in the Magruder rotation now. And that's from Extend Beard. Extendbeard.com is where you can find their products. They're also on Instagram and Facebook. And I'll have the links in the description below to all their social medias. I received a beard oil, a beard balm, and a beard wax from this company. And we're gonna go ahead and dive right in. Here's their beard oil. This is the, the scent that they call this is one. So now I have it in all three of the products here. Here's the beard oil, as you can see. This is a one ounce container and an amber glass bottle, protecting it from the UV rays. I'll show you the dropper. Check this out. It has one of them teardrop on it. And I like that because you get the precise amount of drops that you want for your beard i'm starting to see these more and more now and i really like these droppers it's very nice the only downfall to this thing which i'm not complaining check watch the cap it opens itself back up i'm, I'm not a magician it opens itself back up so i'm not going to say this is going to happen on anything you purchase from them but it's happening on mine it's not that big of an issue at all no points knocked off not that big of a deal to me but this is all natural and all organic. I'm gonna read you the ingredients. Actually, before I go into that, I'll look at the label. And the label's very nice. It's kind of glossy, and they, they, did, they did good work, I gotta say. This was dis distributed from the United Kingdom, and it gives you the directions and the precautions. It does tell you it does contain nut oils. It says for exterior use only. If it gets in your eyes, rinse immediately with warm water. It contains nut allergens, tests, nut oils, tests for allergens. Natural ingredients, argan oil, jojoba oil, apricot kernel oil, avocado oil, pumpkin seed oil, sweet almond oil, grape seed oil, castor oil. This is a new one. I do not know what this does or what the properties it contains. Kikui nut oil, glycerin and fragrance naturally derived. And it has the 12, 12 month expiration for the scent and for the oil itself. So it tells you how long the scent's gonna last in the bottle. And while we're on the ingredients, my beard loves you. If you're watching this, this will be your next assignment. I would like for you to do a review and a carrier, carrier oil spotlight on Kikui nut oil, please. So that's your homework for now. So we're gonna go ahead and talk about this oil. This is a really good oil. I'm gonna show you, I really haven't used a lot of this. And I'm gonna tell you why. One is because I'm trying to keep, take baby this because I really really enjoy this scent it's really good and also it's kind of a thick oil I really don't need to put a lot in my beard I can put this in once a day and it keeps it hydrated and moist for the day and this is definitely one of my favorite scents that I have come across for sure this is a two thumbs up for their beard oil I highly suggest you try it now I'm going to tell you what they say, I'm looking at my cheat sheet here. I'm gonna put it right beside the camera. I'm gonna tell you what they say they're, they're hints of. Blonde leather, blood orange, mint, with undertones of cinnamon, grapefruit, rose, and patchouli. Now, what do I get out of this, honestly? This is like a cologne-scented beard oil, but it's not. It's like spicy, and, and, the, and that's what I'm getting from it. And, it's kind of exotic. I, I'm considering this an exotic scent. I took this to work. I let about four or five guys smell this. All of them wanted it immediately. All of them put it on, and they all enjoyed this. So I'm telling you, this is going to be a very interesting scent you're going to want to check out. Two thumbs up for this scent. Two thumbs up for this beard oil. We're going to go ahead and move over to the beard balm. This is a different cont size container. This is a 1.69 ounce beard beard balm and it's in the one container this is and it says here that they are made from made in small batches so it tells me they're a small batch company and all natural ingredients 
And the ingredients are shea butter, mango seed butter, coconut oil, cocoa butter, beeswax, jojoba oil, apricot kernel oil, avocado oil, sweet almond oil, castor oil, vitamin E, fragrance, which was naturally derived. And it tells you, again, about the allergy and where it's distributed. It's a 1.69 ounce beard balm. Kind of a different size, but there's nothing wrong with that. So it's a little under two, uh, two ounces, that's okay. Now I'm gonna go ahead and tell you the ingredients for the beard wax. They're actually not listed on this little container, which I'm gonna estimate this is about a half ounce. I'm not 100% sure, because this is not on their website for purchase. I'm sure that they do have it available, but I'm gonna say this is a half ounce. That's about equivalent to a half ounce tin that I've received in the past. But the ingredients are the same. The only difference, which what they told me, that it has more of a beeswax and shea butter, more, more butters and beeswax that were in this beard balm than it has the oils. So that's why it's considered a wax. It has your screw off container, as you can see. Man, this scent is incredible. Now, I'm gonna show you look this really closely take a look at that right there this is a little grainy now i'm going to show you this is a very i'd say medium holding balm out for sure you see it in my hand it melts away very quickly i forgot that piece give me a second it melts away really nice there is a little bit of grain in it in the beginning but it goes away really quickly. Now, I'm not a scientist or anything when it comes to the beard products, but I live in Pennsylvania, as I've said in my, pre my previous videos, and it's very cold up here. This may be because of the temperature change, because as of right now where I'm outside, it's actually in the 60s, which is not which is what I'm used to here. Most, some of the beard oil balms, when I receive them, they do look kind of grainy like this, but it goes away with no problem whatsoever. I'm not taking any points off of this just for the fact that it's here because it goes right away as you saw. This actually leaves a little bit of a shine on my beard. I'm not going to call it grease because I don't really, I didn't have any, any rings under my collar when I wore this or anything like that, but this one actually left a nice shine. Two thumbs up for this beard balm. Like I said, it's a medium holding balm. I really enjoyed it. It conditioned my hair very, very nicely. And we're going to go ahead and move forward to the beard wax. Like I said, this is about a half ounce container. And it's the exact same ingredients as the beard balm, just with more butters and wax than it has the oils. Since the exact same. You can see that I didn't really use a lot of this because I don't use a lot of beard waxes unless I want to have more hold. And this is definitely a very strong holding beard wax, I gotta say. What I did was I mixed this with the beard balm and I had the best of both worlds. So whenever I wore this, my beard never moved. I'm gonna give this company a two thumbs up and a five star Beard Times with Scott rating today. So what do I like about Extend Beard? I like the fact that this was made out of the United States and they sent this to me. It took about a month to get it to me, but they actually went out of their way and sent this to me to review. And they were, I know they're waiting for this review because they messaged me twice. I apologize for the delay, you guys. I usually give every company at least one week, sometimes two. And if my products line up, I try to do a block of them at a time. So I finally got your review out to you. And I hope you like my review. You guys are getting a two thumbs up. Five star, five star Beer Times with Scott rating, definitely for sure. So if you're looking for an exotic or cologne scent for your beard, which a lot of men are these days, I highly suggest you check out the Extend Beard, Beard Oil, the one scent. This is definitely one of my favorite scents. It is now my wife's favorite scent. It topped a couple of the other, one, other ones, which I'm not gonna mention, that were kind of similar in, in the scent, but this is definitely a keeper. You definitely got to check it out. I'd like to thank you all very much again for watching and keep on bearding. See you soon.